back everybody this is Korath and today we are playing some more Eternal Sun and we are going to continue on our journey if you remember last time we got them beating up a pretty big bad guy it was like a warlock looking dude he was pretty strong and we kicked his ass and now we're here um, and we're about ready to head forward so yeah um, we got trapped by a succubus I think it was and we beat her and found out that uh, she has his that the sister Mariette has actually, or Magellita, or however you want to say it, has a sister named Nai, which is not this sister. So, the story's getting thick. So, we're going to move forward here, so let's go. Now, I think we just found the sister. Sis Magellita. Wait. Okay, so that's her sister. Hmm. Sis Megalita, I finally found you. Let's go. I don't think that's her sister. Okay, so apparently her sister might be possessed by eternity and she just like one shot knocked us out All right And now we're dreaming about the church again I guess we're remembering the past. That dream again, I remember. It was also a raining day. Dad, Mom, Sob, Sob. Nope, here comes the Sis Magaletta. I imagine it. No, what's wrong? Sis Magaletta. I had a dream. A dream of that incident. Of uh, my hometown. Dad and mom. Everything. I. I am scared. Marthy took Megalith away this time. So, so. Okay, so apparently we're sleeping in the same bed, so interesting. So far as we saw, this, that she had a dream about the demon that killed her parents and everything else. And that was, that's how she found out about Sis Maglet that became her sis because of that, isn't it? Sis is always so nice and kind to me. Whenever I'm scared, she is always there for me. A warm hug from her easily calms me down. I am so weak and fragile. To me, Sis is the one and only ray of hope. When she just raised your ass and gave you no hope. Just saying. So now I wake up. She has knocked us the hell out. I passed out. What, what happened? I remember. I saw Sis, and then she kicked my ass. Wah, wah, wah. Oh, don't cry now. No way Sis does not recognize me in her eyes. Possible Sis will not be possessed by eternity. None of those are true. No. Sis Megalithic. Oh, she was probably possessed. She literally knocked us out. She literally went Bolt of light. Next thing you know, our character was like, and she was out. <laughs> the little fairy following us. Sanai! What would happen to those who are possessed by eternity? They will slowly lose their mind. Once eternity fully takes control, they can no longer recover from it. Absolutely no way to recover. Exactly. 
Unless I take over eternity and destroy it. No, that is not going to happen to Sis. Sis is way too nice and strong to lose to eternity. It is impossible. Sis is no puppet of eternity. Sinai, what if your sister really turns into a puppet of eternity? What will you do then? Kick her ass and knock her back into reality? Alright, what is the point of returning to the church without Sis? I'm willing to bet on even the slimmest possibility. Sinai, <sighs> I'm going onward with my search. But what if I will give everything I've got? Whatever it takes, I'm getting Sis back. If I back down right here, then Sis is lost to me forever. Whatever it takes, I'm not giving up. Sis Maglet, she is everything I have. You are determined. I will go with you. You little freaking fairy. Make up your damn mind. Thanks. Damn little fairy. Sad thing is, we haven't even found the other two hidden monsters we're supposed to fight. Um, so unless... We fight them along the path here. We might not be getting any more monsters. Let's go ahead and save on file one. Before we go any further, we need to really see if there's any hidden monsters. Because I don't want to go on and bypass up the monsters to get the ultimate armor. Alright, we're going to smack them around. Smack, smack, smack. And slap. Give them a big old beat down. Like that. Just smack you around. Just smack you around. Just clap, clap, clap. We'll be slapping y'all for days. Oh. Okay, so we're going up a tower, but where's the monsters? Like, the big bosses. Yeah, these little monsters are cool, but I'll, I need the big bosses. Big bosses. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and smack that person. We'll smack that person. Come up behind him and smack him in the butt. That's just not right. Oh god. Why would we get another save point? I better not be at some ending. And I, I really ain't found the other monsters. I mean, I didn't run back beforehand and there was nothing back there, so. Uh huh. It's gonna be like one of those cold things, are you? Gotcha. Oh shit, there's a monster there. Try closing that one and that one. Oh. Damn, man. I'm gonna get through you. Cause there's something up there. Gotcha. Uh-huh, treasure chest. Healing ribbons. Okay. We got a thing called a healing ribbon. Your HP regenerates twice as fast. Well, that's good and all, but I don't want that right now. I'm actually looking for the big monsters. Not really caring about the uh, items. Without those monsters, we won't be able to get the final armors and stuff. So we kind of need them. Game. So spit them out. Spit out the giant monsters. Okay. Watch me be bypassing them up because there's probably switches on them things or something like that. If that's what happens, then so be it.
Got him. So we're going down there. No. Okay, so are you one of the big monsters? So we got one more of the legendary stunts. Now we need one more. And I don't know which way to go. Into the building or up the stairs. So, uh... Shit. <laughs> That's for me not knowing which way to go. But we are definitely going to be taking it off the, uh, lay the cap here. And we are going to upgrade it to the ultimate form. The Demon Lord Cape. And we'll go down to the, the cape, and this will bring it up 2531, so that brings it up by a shit ton. Okay. I want to say the monster's over here. But running this way, I saw a moon. So this might be the way to go. Um, worst case scenario comes, it's not. I make a mistake and have to run back when running in here. But I'm hoping that I was right. It is back there. Okay. Good thing I ran in there to see if I was right or not. We'll go ahead and do that. And now we will run the way it wants us to go. And it's wanting us to run in here. Hopefully this will be where the final boss monster is. Those are sheep slimy and jack in the chest. Alright, so... We got the quest to do. You can find all my chests in the Dim and Frontier. I would suppose give Arcane Realm. Four of eight. Alright, so we beat them so we get the evasion. Seven. Alright, we've done that one. We've done that one. And we're still working on that one. We'll get those. Alright, so. We passed it up somewhere back there. Which, on my own time, I will go and get all that. Um... So, you know, we don't have to stay here and waste the whole episode running just to get to it. Um, we'll save here. And that will do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button or subscribe down below. I'm going to go back, look for that other monster I missed, beat it up, get all the items, um, fix up my stuff, get all the treasure chests and everything else hopefully before the next episode so with that said i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did i'm glad i will catch you guys next time this is korok i'm out y'all have fun